we doing here? You're too comfortable. I'm making it easy for you. I'm playing house, I'm cooking dinner, your clothes are clean and folded. Like, what are we doing? Because I'm not getting any younger. My name is Chrissy, and Jim Jones is my man. He's a rapper, businessman, and a hustler. I love Jimmy, and we've been together for six years. But still, there's no ring, and we have no children together. So sometimes I gotta ask myself, where are we really going with this? Anyway, I just wanna tell you happy birthday, and I love you. You're a year older, and you need to start thinking about things that are more substantial, more permanent in life. Did you say I know? Holy <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it's time for us to grow up. So I guess this is over. Yeah, this, this playing thing is over, exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't get it together, you forget it forever. That's a hard in the round. I don't put that in my round. Mm-hmm. Don't get it together, forget it forever. She means the world to me. She's there for me. She's exciting. She's the bomb. You heard? My nizzle could be ready to spike Leah. You heard me? I could be ready to do the right thing. Ice Cube's involved. Maybe I. I'm sure. I've been wanting to talk to Liv about something for a minute now, and being that Jimmy is focused on those cards, I'm feeling like it's the perfect time to slip away. I got something that I really need to tell you. Is good or bad? Been with Jimmy for about six years. Yeah. And it seems like he's always with me, but I have to initiate everything. And I get to a point where sometimes I get frustrated with that, but that's that's my man. What you deal with? I do, because he's worth it. Mm -hmm and I'm ready for children and marriage and everything else. And I think that I'm gonna have to like roll up my sleeves. So I think I'm gonna ask him to marry me. Like for real? Like, like propose, like down on one knee with a ring, everything. I'm with it. I think it's fly. You scared? Yeah. Terrified. I think it's fly. I was very surprised and very happy to take herself out of that situation and be like, it, I'm gonna propose. I don't care if I'm the one getting down on my knee to tell my man how much I love him when it's supposed to be the other way around. That takes a lot out of a woman to do. I think that that's dope. If you love him and you know that he's probably not ready to take that step, you take the initiative. You always done that and he's always come behind you afterwards, just do it. It would be nice to have it, you know, the traditional way, but ain't traditional Which in my but life. It works, <laughs> it works. Yeah. Do that, my little munchkin. Oh, come give you a little. I got so emotional telling um, Olivia about it because a part of me is like stomping and kicking, like, no, we want him to ask you. But I don't have time for that. So let's just go ahead and get this union together because if it's gonna be me and you, then let's make it me and you. I'm honored. No, I really am honored so, that you told me. But this gonna be our little project. Like, okay. And uh, but look, mm -hmm. I have a real estate agent and a moving company. Just in case. Because if he says no, he's getting the f out, out of is. my house. <laughs> I'm with it. I'm with it. All right. Hi. How are you? How you doing? Doing? Good. Mm. Good to see you. Likewise. I'm going to buy Jimmy a ring, an engagement ring. If I'm going to propose to Jimmy, I got to come correct. So I want to see Ivy, his jeweler. I mean, we've known him forever. So if anybody knows what Jimmy would like, it would be him. So do you think I'm a nut job for doing this? Sometimes we need a little push. If we don't get a push, we can't get it done. He thinks I need some sick, you know, $300,000 stone. No, he's tripping, yeah. you know? So if that's stopping him. How's, how's this looking? Let's... It looks good, but what size stones would be? We're going to put um, 10 pointers. I want them nice and chunky. That big? Is that big enough? Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Double rolled all the way Double around. Double rolled all around. Mm -hmm. Okay, you said white gold, right? Yes. All right, tell me what do you think? All right, so nice white dancing diamonds. Dancing diamonds, okay. all white diamonds. I can't believe I'm doing this. I know, it's crazy. What do you think, do you want to say yes? <laughs> I think so. Uh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. I... Part of me was like, that's right, ask him. You know he ain't going to say no. And another part is going, well, he hasn't asked you, and maybe because he's not ready. 
On my way down the stairs, I have all these thoughts. Like, you're gonna ask this man to marry you in front of a room of his friends, family, your friends, family, but they have no idea what's going on. What if he says no? Are you prepared for that? I need my support system in the front. Me? Yes. <laughs> is she, is there an engagement going on? Is there a oh, engagement going on? Okay. Jim is Nancy's man, basically. You know what I'm saying? Nancy doesn't want anybody else taking that position. And if Chrissy goes into that slot where I know they're going, Nancy's finna be upset. <laughs> I would like to start by saying thank you for coming out. It's good to see you guys. You all know me very well. We all know that I've tried several different ventures in my life. I tried the real estate, interior design, personal styling, never quite fit. It's taken me a long time to figure out exactly what I wanted to do with my life. Have I figured it out? I want to spend it with you. <laughs> I'm a wreck. My little hands were shaking. And then as the words started to flow out, it's like I tuned out. Like I just let what I came for take over. I don't know what's going on in Nancy's head, but that woman is really tight right now. Mom, mom, no, no. mom, mom, please, no, please. no, mom, please. Everybody, leave me right, right now, right now, leave me right now. Please, just yeah, one minute. Let me go one minute. No, no, I don't need no surprise. My son, yes, I can understand him getting a surprise. I could have been more coming up towards the front just to get my son's expression and camera and had everything ready. I don't know what's going on. All I know is, oh, no. I, I just can't believe I'm just excluded out. They're not waiting for the guys anymore. They know they know we'll take forever, so they taking matters into their own hands. You sure you want to do that? Yeah. I thought long and hard. Yeah. You thought long and hard. Yes. I can't see myself with anybody else. I'm with you. But he didn't quite say yes. He was like, I'm with you. What the is I'm with you? What does that mean? Yeah, you didn't say yes. What's up with that? I did say yes. I'm still here. My clothes are still upstairs. I love Jimmy, like, more than I thought that I could ever love anybody. But it's like, Chrissy, you're not only signing up for him, unfortunately. You're signing up for Nancy, too he kind of lets me and his mother just go at it. And that's not right. You have to have a say, one way or the other. So now we got to move on to wedding planning. <laughs> Listen, I'm not planning a wedding, and y'all don't need to start planning that right now anyway, so. You scared? I'm scared of what? To be married? All I said was I don't think this is the adequate time to be talking about this. Marriage is a whole different ball game. Half the people in my family marriages last, half the people in my family marriages didn't. So, you know, I'm 50-50 on the marriage thing, so. I made it too easy for you. What you make easy for me? This whole lifestyle, this whole comfy lifestyle you have, I made it too freaking easy for you. So you don't take anything serious. It's not official until you get down on one knee. What, what? I was supposed to get down on one knee and 
tie the my left, horse up and knee. take off my armor the left and then knee. ask you. Oh. Aw, Come up here. Okay, okay, okay. Sit down, stop. Okay, 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 okay. So you know what? I'll never bring it up again. And if we stay engaged oh, for more than here we go. time here that we I'm go. comfortable with, I'm leaving. Let's take the dog with you too. Come on, I'm gonna play you something. I'm gonna show you something. Come on. If Jimmy says to me, I'm not the marrying type, then it's up to me to decide what I wanna do. But I don't want him to make a decision for me by not saying anything. Just tell me what's going on with you and let me decide. First option in my last resort, Chris. We was both laughing when you crashed the Porsche. Word. I still remember when you bring the cash to court. Remember that? And sometime, girl, I feel we on the crash course. Got that Shit. fixed though, right? We've been through real situations. A couple times you had to punch a couple bitches' faces. Almost got me lost. Yeah. And all that pain you endured. Sorry, I'm trying to that. tell you it won't be the same moving forward. I'm trying to work That's not the first song that Jimmy has written for me or to me. Like, I don't know if he's trying to pacify me with it, but it's, it's wearing thin. I'm starting to see right through it. I think she was digging it because she kind of calmed down and got back to her regular self a little bit. So I'm proud of myself. Push my buttons like a coat to seat a in a wife beater. Baby, bring it back because I'm a. Hey, what's the oldest great honor here today? Yeah, responsibility. That's why we're here. Jim and I are in the Diamond District. And I know you might be thinking that um, he's gonna get me a ring. Oh, but no. We're there because Einstein lost his engagement ring. Imagine what I'm going through. Imagine Chrissy lost her ring. That's why I ain't buy one. Chrissy yet. doesn't have one, so. Oh, well, no, it's a big deal, though. What do we have to do to replace it? I have to go back into your files. Give me All a right. sec, I'll be right back. Okay. Let's see how big this Can is. Can you tell time? Me? I don't even buy watches for time, you know that. I bought watches for shine. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you. Okay, okay, enough. Okay? <laughs> Are we doing the right thing? But what? Replacing this ring. Yeah, why not? Just don't mm -hmm. lose this one, okay? Make sure I don't lose this ring. I was heartbroken when, when, when I couldn't find the ring. I was heartbroken too. I know. Now you're going crazy like I like. Because it, it settled in that you lost this damn ring. I already took a huge step to even ask him to marry me. I understand that mistakes and accidents happen but um, I'm not feeling good about this one. Here's the ring, the okay. design of the ring. It was ice all around. Yeah, 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 that's just a rough sketch of it, but. But yeah, like that. Uh, I remember you and Ivy were uh, looking at a stone. Yes, we were. So, Jim, is it all right if I show you the stone? You show, it, were... show it to her. I, mean, I ain't here to look at no stone. So. I'm good enough to put up with all your but I'm not good enough to be your wife. That's a problem. If he doesn't do the right thing in the amount of time that I feel it's fair, then we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. But I don't think it's gonna be pretty. Here's a stone, Chris. This is a six character you guys were looking at before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's making you choke? <laughs> How much is that A quarter million. Half a million no, in the bag. A quarter, not a half. She should want a ring. She deserves a ring. She's been with me through thick and thin, and, and sticking with me is not the easiest thing in the world, so you know. I think I am going to purchase a painkiller for today. Is that yours? A painkiller is something that you get when you can't get exactly what you want. These would be painkillers. Mm hmm. They dope. I guess they dope. I can have these? I, I don't know. Can you? Yep, I can. You know, I'm starting to feel like I was set up. We should have been in that store buying my ring. But instead, we were there to replace his. So this is the least he can do. Hopefully next time you see me, it'll be for a different reason, you know? Very good, very good. Okay. Thank you so much. Jim, pleasure. Listen. Hmm? I want to hear this different reason. Where are you taking me? Surprise. Ta-da! How cute, Jimmy. This is a Moroccan. Uh-huh. New York rocking thing. I love it when Jimmy gives me attention. Like, he has a crazy schedule. And for him to do this for me tonight, it means a lot. Cheers. To what? To a long life of dealing with you. I love you. How about that? Okay. Love you too, babe. The Moroccan dinner was cute, but I was
was expecting something a little more. Mr. Jones, mango shrimp with your little Moroccan theme. Okay. Bon appetit, enjoy. Okay. Bon appetit. Yo, I feel like my food is so far away from me. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. You didn't do this by yourself. Who helped you with this? Listen to me. Okay, so you came here and you wrapped these lights around everything and you lit all these fucking candles and you put these pillows here? Shit, you blow me up. These candles don't even take matches. Where you get these pillows from? Right there on Houston Street. Where on Houston Street? Pottery Barn. I bet you these shit say Home Goods or some shit. They don't say Pottery Barn. Yeah. <laughs> Stop being a liar. <laughs> Who helped you with this? You know, I told you, Annie, I wanted to do something smooth, so. She's not here, though, is she? Oh, I'm hoping she don't pop out. Okay, because I ain't ready for is that. Not, this yet. is Moroccan, not Jamaican. Like, just two <laughs> different things. <laughs> My love for Chrissy is unconditional. I mean, I don't know how much more it can grow. <laughs> I'm about to blow up. It's, it, it, it's grown so much. Every day I love her even more. I love her for the person she is. You do a lot, you've been through a lot, and on top of been through a lot, you gotta deal with me, so, you know, you deserve a break. We here with the Moroccan theme. And my ass is hurting, but thank you. We gonna play it a little bit different next time. <laughs> but I appreciate it all the same. Yeah. I really do. I appreciate you. Thank you, babe. I appreciate this. There's a foreign car in my driveway. What is it doing here? Jimmy, whose car is this? That's Joel's car. I don't buy white cars. You want me to call Joel's right now? He'll tell me that it's his car? Joel just went out of town. That's why he told me to hold the car. His phone works. What do you He's mean? He's on a flight. Oh, now you want to get stupid? What? It'd be a problem if I was to get a new car? You have other things to spend your money on right now. You might have some extra money. Jimmy's always buying some type of stupid car and bringing it home. If a car was at the top of your to-do list, it's time for me to be realistic with where Jimmy's head is. I don't want to see this car. I want it out of my driveway. All right, so I'll park it around the corner. And that's why I'll have your mail sent, too, around the corner. I got to stand firm. It's my car, my money. I cop that. It's my castle, you heard? I don't know what's going on with you, like, right now. But what you think is going on with me right now? Like, what's on your mind? Well, first of all, you didn't even tell me you were getting a new car. So you just what? show up with it? You didn't tell me you was getting the last pair of 10 shoes that came to the house. Shoes and cars, no comparison. Then you just had a pair of shoes that cost $6,000. And what are you talking about shoes and cars with no comparison? When a fucking pair of shoes could be a down payment for a brand new car. So knock it off. OK, we getting caught up on shoes? Yeah. Oh, now we getting caught up on shoes, right? Because this conversation really isn't about a car or shoes. Now, like, my shoes are not coming before you. And this car is? I feel like, yeah, this is another painkiller for you. A painkiller? I don't know what's going on with him. I just know that I've loved him forever, and it's time to grow up. I understand his struggle. I understand all of that, you know? So I've been patient because of it. Now I'm getting a little tired. How much more you want me to take? How much yeah. more you want to see I can take? Because you just don't want to keep playing house. Uh, I'm talking to you for a second. Oh. What is going on? You all right? Yeah. How much more you want me to take? How much yeah. more you want to see I can take? Because you just don't want to keep playing house. Uh, I'm talking to you for a second. Oh. You got beef? Hi. What's up? Why are you running up on me like you got beef with me? She's going for a second. What is he doing in Miami? I left him in the house. And now you're invading my space with this aggression? You having a good time down here? Yeah, I was until you rolled up on me like we got beef. You love Miami, right? I do love Miami. Yeah? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. I don't even know you're here in town. You roll up on me and tap me like I owe you money. Like, what's the matter? Hmm. 
You always think something funny, right? I don't know what your problem is. You're not telling me. You better stop yelling at me. I'm no, I'm not going to stop yelling at you, you because stop. you came down here like a retard, and you're not telling me what's wrong with you. I'm going to show you how fucking crazy I am. What you got for me? Some information in your pocket? Like, what are you digging for? I got that information for you. So you want to marry me? special occasion. This is to let her know how much I love her and how unconditional my love is. You deserve it, kiddo. You deserve it. Everybody follow me. Let's have a drink. How y'all feeling? Oh, no, oh, you come over here. Oh. Come oh. <laughs> Jimmy took the time out to invite my friends and my family. I couldn't have asked for anything more. I don't have a secret, too. Okay. <laughs> as crazy as Nancy is, I do love her. Nancy is a handful, but the way she loves her son is enough for me to respect who she is and what she's been through, and we don't see eye to eye. But I have a place in my heart for her. I always have. <laughs> Jimmy got so many extra points for making sure that the people that were important to me were there and a part of it. Like, we already married in my mind. That was like beautiful. Because it wasn't typical. But you know, it was, it was Jeremy. It was Jim. You can't even say it was nothing. It was yeah. Jim. Like, this is crazy right here. Don't lose it in the gym now. <laughs> Gorgeous. That's all right. That's all right. Don't punch nobody with that ring on. Baby, I'm turned over newly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to use my shoes this time. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm a Jones. I'm a Jones. Well, not officially, but I. you know what? I am. I'm a Jones. OK, here we go. I'm scared. Let's go. For life. Right. 10, 20 years. Uh -huh. I'm going to see how this go down the line. <laughs> Good thing. That's okay. all I got to say. Good thing. We're going to do this. OK. OK. Love you. Mean, no, me and you going to do this. We're going to do this. We gonna okay. Do this. We, OK. 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 <laughs> you can't make a man do what he doesn't want to do. Sometimes you have to force him to realize what's right. And it all came together. And that's all I ever really wanted. <sighs> and even if we never get married, I will fuck with Jimmy in my heart for the rest of my life. Because he put his ego aside. He put his persona aside. And he put our love first. And I will forever love him for that. 
We was both laughing when you crashed the Porsche. Word. I still remember when you bring the cash to court. Remember that? And sometimes, girl, I feel we on the crash course. So today we're going to the Dolphin Cove in Jamaica. Jimmy, he's acting like a little kid. Like, he's amped. He wants to do this. He wants to swim with the dolphins. Can't believe it, but he's really happy about this. When the dolphins were pushing Jimmy out of the water, the look on his face was priceless. He was just like a happy little kid. Yo, yo. There you go. Hey, Bruno, what up? It's been real, but I gotta go. Yes. It was real good to see you and my mom together. That was the, uh, that was just the main reason I, I really wanted to bring you all out here. And to see you and my mom's getting along and that's dope. That's what I, I've been dreaming of. It was needed, it was necessary, and it was fun. It has been a tumultuous year. There's been valleys, there's been peaks, there's been disappointment, there's been surprise, but I can't say there's been growth. Like, I'm in a space where I love my family. And um, that's really all I wanted. What y'all doing? I'm trying to talk him into catching a fish, but he's not cooperating. Look what I caught, and it got teeth. No, oh, <laughs> for real, yo, yo, for real, yo. OK, I'll put him back in the But he got teeth, you know that, right? He don't have teeth. He got teeth. Yo, mommy, said, yo, could y'all put that back in the water for <laughs> Ooh, real? Oh, he's vibrating. Put him in the water, please. Like, for real, y'all playing too much. I yeah. caught one. I want to know, can they do something can with the one? Can they dry his ass Yeah, up? because that's the one I caught. Mommy, you, not, you didn't catch anything. They don't move. OK, but <laughs> I caught it. I picked it up. I had a ball with Nancy. It was so needed. And we all know Nancy's going to be crazy. That's what we love about Nancy. I'm feeling like we need to do this a lot more often. I really appreciate it. I thank you all for writing me on this vacation with you all. But I really thank you all. Mm. Mm. So you. better. Mm. Mm. So I guess I'll go back and go look for the naked beach. Please don't find a nude beach. We going to the naked beach. No. Mm-hmm. Take the starfish with you. <laughs> <laughs> He's naked already, right? <laughs> Hey, you guys, your girl Tahiri Jose. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you watch, make sure you subscribe to the brand new Love and Hip Hop YouTube channel.